Hi, this is Chris with the tutorial in AutoCAD. Today we'll create two custom paper sizes and we'll learn how to print a document in grayscale. Let's take a look. Let's begin by creating two custom page sizes. I'm going to type in Plotter Manager. This brings up a window that has our plotter configurations in it. I'm going to copy this one and paste it in here and I'm going to rename it with legal size. Now I'm going to double click this to bring up the plotter configuration editor. I click device document settings and then custom paper sizes. Click add Start from scratch. Next, I want this to be 14 inches wide, 8.5 inches tall. Next, I'm going to make these all 0.5 inches. If you know what your printer's uh, edges are, you can start with those in the printable area. Next, we'll create a name for this particular paper size. I will call this Legal Landscape PDF. And next, I finish. I'm going to add another one. This one is going to be 8.5 by 14. This one will be also 0.5 for all of these margins. This one I will call Eagle Portrait PDF. Click Next and Finish. I now have two new custom paper sizes that I can choose from. Let me close this and I will minimize this window. Next, from within our document, type Layout. We'll click N for New, and we'll call this Landscape. You can call it whatever you like. Once we've got our Landscape layout, click on the tab for the Landscape, and you should get this Page Setup Manager. If you don't automatically get the Page Setup Manager, you can right-click on the Landscape tab, and go to Page Setup Manager. And we're going to modify Landscape. We're going to change this from Adobe PDF to PDF with legal size. We'll change our paper size to Legal Landscape. And our second goal to accomplish today was to change this to grayscale. So let's make this grayscale under plot style. That accomplishes both of our goals. Let's make a few quick changes to the layout and then we'll do a test print. Pull down from File to Export to PDF. And let's take a look at our document, see if there's very much grayscale in there. Looks like we have some. This confirms that we're printing in various shades of gray. This should be enough information to get you started with custom page sizes and grayscale printing in AutoCAD. This is Chris with Laughter on Water. Thanks for watching.